Hello friends, welcome back to Global Travel Venture. Ever wondered what secrets airports are hiding from you? Airports they're not just mere transit points but rather intricate mazes, bustling with mystery and a dash of adventure. Imagine a city within a city where thousands of people coexist, each with their own story. But what if I told you that these vast expanses of concrete and steel hold more than just the stories of weary travelers and eager holidaymakers? You see, airports are like icebergs. The terminals, runways, and lounges we see are just the tip of it all. Underneath, there's a whole hidden world, a labyrinth of secrets, teeming with life, running around the clock. From the moment you step into an airport, you become a part of a grand ballet, with every move choreographed to the smallest detail. The check-in counters, the security checks, the boarding gates, they all serve a purpose beyond what meets the eye. But what exactly are they? In this city of constant motion, even the most mundane details have a purpose. Did you know that the carpeting in most airports isn't just for aesthetics or comfort? Or that the windows aren't merely for viewing the planes? And what about those unassuming airport lounges? Could they be hiding something? And then there's the food. Ever wondered why your in-flight meal tastes a certain way? Or why the food at the airport seems just a tad bit different than what you're used to? The answers lie in the secret world of airports. Beyond the hustle and bustle, there's a world that thrives on precision, speed, and a bit of cunning. From the handling of your luggage to the placement of parking lots, there's a science and an art to it all. But fear not, for we're about to delve into these mysteries and unravel the secrets that airports have been keeping from us. We're about to look beyond the departure boards, beyond the check-in counters, and beyond the sprawling runways. Are you ready to uncover what's been hidden right under your nose? Let's dive into the secret world of airports. Ever noticed how some airports are eerily quiet? It's not a coincidence, but a carefully crafted strategy employed by certain airports around the globe. Welcome to the world of silent airports. Instead of blaring announcements every few minutes, these airports have opted for a quieter, more peaceful environment. They've traded the constant noise for visual cues. Think about it. Digital boards flashing flight information, signs guiding you to your gate, and even subtle floor patterns leading the way to baggage claim. Silent airports are like a symphony where the instruments are your senses, working together to create a harmonious travel experience. It's a game of show, not tell. It's about reducing noise pollution and fostering an atmosphere of tranquility amidst the typical hustle and bustle. So next time, when you find yourself in a seemingly quiet airport, know that it's all part of the plan. Think parking at the airport is expensive? Think again, the art of parking is not as complex as it seems. You've probably experienced the sticker shock of short-term airport parking rates, but there's a trick to bypass this. Instead of parking in the expensive short-term lots, consider the long-term parking lots. These are typically located a bit farther from the terminal but offer much more reasonable rates. But wait, there's more. Some nearby hotels offer park and fly packages. You spend a night at the hotel, leave your car in their lot, and take their shuttle to the airport. This can often be cheaper than parking at the airport, especially for longer trips. So next time you're planning a trip, don't just accept the high cost of airport parking. Do a little research, compare your options, and you might just find a better deal. Remember, a little research can save you from burning a hole in your pocket. Ever wondered why airport food is so expensive? Well, let's break it down. A major reason is the high rent costs eateries have to pay to be in the airport. These spaces are prime real estate and the price reflects that. Then, there's the logistics. Delivering fresh ingredients to these establishments isn't as easy as your neighborhood grocery run. It's a complex operation with security checks and tight schedules, all of which add to the overall cost. Plus, the eateries need to pay their staff a premium to work in such a bustling environment. Now here's a handy trick to dodge these high prices. Pack your own snacks. Yes, as long as they're not liquid, you can carry them through security. Alternatively, scout for eateries located outside the terminal. They're often cheaper and offer a wider variety of choices. So next time, make sure to plan ahead and save some cash on food. Did you know airports have secret rooms? That's right. Tucked away from the hustle and bustle of the busy terminals, there exist hidden spaces that serve specific purposes. Take, for instance, the prayer rooms. These quiet sanctuaries offer a place of solace for passengers of all faiths, a spot to meditate or pray before a long journey. In addition to these, there are also restrooms specifically designed for the flight crew. These aren't your average break rooms but fully equipped spaces for pilots and attendants to catch some much-needed shut-eye during long layovers. Then, there are special rooms for unaccompanied minors. 
These spaces provide a safe and comfortable environment for children traveling alone, ensuring they are well taken care of until they board their flight or are picked up by a guardian. So, the next time you're at an airport, remember, there's more than meets the eye. Ever felt helpless when your flight is delayed or cancelled? It's a feeling many of us know all too well. But what if I told you there's a trick to flip the script? That's right, the power of redress. Imagine this, you're at the airport, bags packed, ready for your much-awaited vacation. But then, the dreaded announcement comes. Your flight is delayed. Hours turn into a whole day. Frustration mounts. But here's where understanding passenger rights and the concept of airline redress comes in. Airline redress in simple terms, is the compensation or other remedies that an airline provides to you for any inconvenience caused. It's a way for the airline to make it up to you when things go awry. But many passengers are not aware of these rights, and that's exactly what some airlines bank on. So what are these rights? Well, they vary depending on the country and the airline. But in general, if your flight is delayed for more than three hours or canceled, you could be entitled to compensation. This could range from a few hundred to a few thousand dollars, depending on the distance and duration of your delay. In some cases, airlines are also obliged to provide meals, refreshments, and even hotel accommodations for longer delays. Additionally, if your baggage is lost or damaged, you may be entitled to compensation for the inconvenience and the cost of the items lost. However, it's not always a straightforward process. Airlines might try to avoid paying by citing extraordinary circumstances. But don't be deterred. If you believe you're entitled to redress, stand your ground. Research, know your rights, and if necessary, seek legal help. There are organizations and resources available to guide you through the process. The power of redress is in your hands, and it's all about being informed. So the next time you face a flight disruption, remember, it's not just about accepting the inconvenience. It's about knowing your rights and demanding what you're entitled to. Knowing your rights can be a game changer when dealing with flight disruptions. Tired of waiting endlessly for your luggage? Picture this. You've just landed after a long flight, and all you want to do is grab your suitcase and head home. But instead, you're standing by the carousel, watching as bags that aren't yours go round and round. Here's a neat trick to outsmart the system. Mark your luggage as fragile. This isn't just about ensuring your stuff is handled with care. When you check in your bag and mark it as fragile, it often gets loaded last and thus, unloaded first. That means it's likely to be one of the first bags on the carousel when you reach your destination. Of course, it's important to note that this isn't a foolproof method. Sometimes, bags marked as fragile can end up taking a bit of extra time as handlers take care to move them. But on the whole, it's a trick worth trying. Remember, a little trick can save you a lot of time. Ever noticed how airport windows are always clean? You might think it's down to an army of window cleaners, working around the clock to keep them spotless, but the truth is, a little more high-tech. Airports around the world are increasingly using self-cleaning glass technology. This fascinating innovation works in two stages. First, the glass is coated with a layer of titanium dioxide, a substance that reacts with sunlight to break down organic dirt. Then, when it rains, instead of forming droplets, the water spreads evenly across the glass surface, taking the loosened dirt with it. The result? Windows that stay clean come rain or shine without the need for manual cleaning. This technology saves airports time and money, not to mention reducing the risk of accidents from high-altitude window cleaning. So next time when you admire the view through the spotless windows, remember, it's science at work. Ever felt frustrated with customer service at airports? We've all been there, haven't we? Long queues, delayed flights, lost luggage, or just plain poor service. It's enough to give the most seasoned traveler a headache. But what if I told you there's a secret weapon to combat these woes? A tool that's right at your fingertips, literally. That's right, we're talking about social media. Now you might be thinking, how can posting a picture of my latte or tweeting about the latest football game help me at an airport? But hear me out. Social media has evolved from a platform for sharing personal moments to a powerful tool for communication and feedback. Let's say you're stuck at an airport, your flight has been delayed for the third time and you're getting no answers from the staff. What do you do? You whip out your smartphone, log on to Twitter and send a direct message to the airline's account. More often than not, you'll get a response faster than you would at the customer service desk. Why is that? Well, airlines, like many businesses, have social media teams who monitor their accounts around the clock. They're there to engage with customers, answer queries, and most importantly, manage their brand's reputation. A public complaint on social media can be seen by thousands if not millions of people. It's in their best interest to resolve your issue quickly and efficiently. 
but it's not just about complaints. Social media can also be your go-to source for real-time updates. Many airlines and airports have Twitter feeds dedicated to providing the latest information on delays, cancellations, and gate changes. So, before you dash off to the gate only to find your flight has been delayed, check your airline's Twitter feed. It could save you a lot of unnecessary stress. So remember, when in need, your smartphone can be your best friend. Harness the power of social media and turn your travel woes into a smoother, more enjoyable journey. So, are you ready to conquer your next airport adventure? We've revealed 8 tricks that airports would rather keep under wraps. Now, armed with this insider knowledge, you're set to navigate your way through the labyrinth of terminals, lounges, and runways like a seasoned traveler. Let's take a quick trip down memory lane. Remember the silent symphony that orchestrates the smooth operation of airports? Now you know it's not just a chaotic buzz of activity. Every movement, every sound has a purpose. And who could forget the art of parking? That seemingly mundane task is actually a secret trove of savings waiting to be discovered. The same goes for the food. Yes, it's more than just sustenance. It's a well-planned strategy to keep you calm and comfortable during your journey. Our exploration of the hidden rooms revealed a world that many travelers are oblivious to. These secret spaces serve as the backbone of airport operations. Then we discussed the power of redress. It's not just about expressing dissatisfaction, it's about standing up for your rights as a passenger. Of course we can't forget the luggage trick. A small tweak in the way you handle your bags can make a world of difference. And the secret behind the windows? It's not just about aesthetics, it's about your safety and comfort. Lastly we touched on the power of social media. It's more than a platform for sharing selfies and travel updates. It's a tool that can make your airport experience smoother and more enjoyable. As you embark on your next journey, we encourage you to put these tricks to the test. And when you do, share your experiences. Let us know if these strategies enhanced your travel experience. After all, knowledge is meant to be shared. Remember, every airport has a story to tell. You just need to know where to look. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like share and subscribe for more videos like this.